Hello champion, some blue red player in this game today we're playing on with Dragon's Labyrinth map and let's see where we've got the most of our troops, right? Well, it seems like in this hall guys called solo halls, but probably somebody is going to go for a solo stun, so that could be a little bit complicated. On the other hand, I can just simply try making alliance requests with all of the players guys, but mostly that where it will depend on the pink player. When it comes to him, well guys, he got another great spawn and he could go for this one. So not necessarily he'll go for this guys, he might still go for or white stone so maybe when i just simply take over this soul stone myself guys and expand to soul holes myself as well i think that would be the play guys and since i've got some more troops to go to the plateau as well i might be dominating over the entire right side it seems so far the black player is going for madman smith guys and the blue player for shadow maze both holes are in the middle which is which are a little bit harder to hold a fortress by white well the white player got a fight for parameters one right where guys will he be going in between black and blue would be obvious Obviously hilarious to see it guys on the right so at the very least he's not adding more truth at where guys will he prevent the pink player from taking over it guys right where that's not so good don't you blitz pink blitz a territory of black let's see if i trust by pink guys right so the pink player's turn could depend a lot whether i get a good start or not guys and so far it doesn't look as much promising do not like the pink player going right there at all guys could he end up failing some of these blitzes and ending up clearing out this hole to me though let's see and so far he still isn't adding more troops guys right yes please go right there sorry or to some other place of the map don't you dare going for this soul stun yes nice 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 key okay, but come on you two places right where guys not good still at the very least he'll be waiting for some more turns right where i guess right the black player that sets my lance request six travels by me do i go for soul holes guys or do i go for ghostly plateau right where technically i could finish taking over this in turn one guys if i get good enough blitzes but at the same time a lot of players could break with me as well let's see well two more troops right where i guess well and yes let's just simply go right where like this guys let's take over very territories right there let's go final blitz guys only seven percent chance to fail we make it and let's try to find more troops this way like even the pearl player didn't accept my lance request guys might have been smarter to fortify this troop next to moon door right there in case right where he tried doing this two versus small roll or blitz but hopefully he doesn't right there at the very least we increase our territorial top number so if either of his players just somebody captures one territory of ours guys then it won't be as much of a deal but if i lose a lot of territories then it won't be so good right and the pearl player goes right there guys will he wipe out the white player guys yes he does nice three throws by black right will be black player break for me okay well adds one more troop right there so not enough troops for that okay one more troop right there guys and he wanted to add one more troop right there is he trying to spread out or something or what is he even doing right there guys is he trying to target my territory sorry okay well not just simply one troop territory guys and that's it but still that right where he had more troops right there <laughs> and in the blue player as well guys the blue player is definitely not appreciating that guys he's about to blitz these so the black player doesn't even add more of them right yeah i do not think he'd blitz the white player first guys right where the black player basically makes himself to get blitz first all right where the blue player captures a territory of one right there as well guys with that so not as much ideal to me at the very least the white player flag guys I, I guess he already noticed what he got wiped out from this here's the pink player guys i'll send him a thumbs up because right where if the pink player just simply doesn't break from me then i end up holding this guys it will be immediately my turn next hopefully he still doesn't have enough troops to finish taking over the cell guys let's see okay well is he why is he adding more troops at where guys i'd like to expand right where next so if you're adding more troops at where then i should go right where pink and wipe you out right oh thumbs up right where so far i'll still be friends with the pink player guys because right where the pink player could break through me with his six troops so what do you want to do right where guys do i want to go right where i think yes i do let's go let's add more troops over there too guys and let's add more troops right there like this right at the very least if we get broken into our whole western guys at the very least right where we'll end up capturing some extra territories which is still good let's go and fortify like this three throws with purple all right i mean so that should have definitely brought other players attention on me guys and so i mean the purple player could even still try doing this or the blue player well the blue player would have to add more throws right well let's see to very least the purple player is busy taking over this whole guys and he ends his turn three throws by black obviously my goal in this game is to try is to try to snowball the game the whole game guys and let's see if i am able to achieve that i mean how is the black player planning to take over this part guys of madman's maze he'd have to go all the way around here 
for me or for Mr. E. Tore Saberberg. Should should be careful about that, obviously, for Tore's Be Blue. Alright, he'll obviously prioritize adding his source at where, guys, he isn't adding more source at where or build he. Two Ice Blades, guys, alright, well, still could be possible, but no, okay, right where? And a hard by ping, guys, let's send him a hard two right where. Nice, nice, nice. Means we ping players all right where would give him plus four trips, guys. So as long as right where I'd be able to take over soul calls and goes to plateau, guys, a much better deal to me. Just to simply make sure the pink player doesn't break for me, but right where even if he breaks for me, right where he have to guard these different borders. So the pink player would risk a lot right where betraying me for throws by him. Well, I mean, he could still betray me right where, but I mean, basically, I'd still have advantage since I'm at more throws right where. But basically, he wouldn't achieve to the game much right where. Then it comes to his own position, guys, but he might... <laughs> Obviously prevents me from winning this game if he decided to mess with me right now. Right, 15 trips. I'll thumbs up to you right there. Let's go right there. I have to make sure to protect these borders over there, guys. Let's <laughs> right there do some attention right there. Let's pay some attention right there, guys. Right. I should be really, really careful about that. Two more troops right there, guys. One more troop right there. I'll just simply end up taking over this. And let's fortify my fire troop army right there like this, guys. So that the black player doesn't break rice either. Three troops by purple. So far, the purple player is busy, guys. Right there. The blue player could potentially break rice because she got an army right there. And right there. And he he already taken over Shadow Maze. So right where I'm mostly worried about the blue player, guys, because if the pink player wanted to break through me, then he would have broken through me already. Could still break through me, but right where I've got a lot of advantage, guys, that would be a death sentence to the pink player if he breaks through me. So right where he just simply has to rely on me right now, guys. Right? <laughs> That's basically some sort of jail to him right there, guys. Behind my armies right there. Right, and the black player starts capturing territories right there. Now, guys, that's interesting. 11 throws by blue, guys, and yes, here is the biggest spawn right there, guys. Don't you see he's breaking through the purple player, guys? I think, yes, he does, which will even help me even more to win this game, guys. Okay, well, no. Here at where he goes for a crystal garden, which I guess is a smart decision. Or is it? Because I could add more troops right there, guys, and still wipe out. I mean, still attack him right there, guys, which I might do it. I might do that. Let's see. All right, well, plus six and plus six. So plus 12 troops total for calling this for the blue player and right where my advantage rings of that. Right, so well, the black player at the very least gives up, guys. Gives up the whole game. He throws away pink. Right, so I think he just simply tries expanding to ice maze right there, which I guess is fine, right? Myself, I either want to break through the blue player right there, guys, or expands to madman's maze. Well, you see, right, well, please, please attack the blue player right there. That would be really appreciated if you do. That's where the pink player is still needed for me as a puppet right there, guys. Right, let's see, right, will he blitz the troops of the blue player too, guys? Okay, well, yes, he does, yes, he does. Let's see, to when it throws by me. Right, well, I'll strengthen this, and I'll strengthen this. Right there, guys. Okay, well, I do not want to. I do not want to actually make the black player as a super easy target, though. So, what I'm going to do right there, guys, is to actually add more troops like there, like this. Let's go, let's take over these guys. How to wipe out the purple and blue players from over there, like this. Let's go. Six throws by purple, guys. But the purple player's position is actually miserable, right there, guys. Let's see what I mean. The blue player could still break for me, depending on what will he end up holding. And I think he'll just simply end up holding both these guys, would be dumb otherwise for other players to break through him, right there. And even increase more of my advantage, right there, he should definitely wipe me out from this place, guys, which is something what he does. Right? 17, even 17 troops for blue. Let's see, blue, what do you do? I should take over this one, guys, and basically make sure that nobody, okay, well, besides the pink player could get the black player, I guess, but if I blitz this fighter up army, guys, right where the white player will be left at one card, right where I do not want to leave a very easy target, right where either. And right, is he, is he actually attacking? Guess a blue player actually attacking the purple player, guys, would be so nice. In this case, I'm even so happy, right where I didn't decide to break through a blue player myself, right where, okay, let's see. And I think he'll stop, right there, right? Right, so we'll split some troops. Split some throws and that's it, that's where 15 throws by pink. Let's see, maybe the pink player betrays me right there, guys. I mean, he ends up holding this. But I mean, that's where I, <laughs> I gave a pink player a strong position on myself as well, right there, guys. Let's see, right, so will he try eliminating somebody or what is he doing, guys? Is that just simply a one troop territory? Even if he attacks this one troop territory of black, guys, that's still helpful because right where I would be able to eliminate the black player from the game, guys. Okay, but the pink player is going for him himself, guys, all right? Well, Good play by the pink player, he could still fail this. And yes, he does, guys. Yes, he does.
Let's go, but I mean smart, smart play by the pink player. On the other hand, okay, well, the set bear is 6 trips, guys. On one hand, it's very 74 trips. Can I go for the killing spree right now? Here is my biggest question. Let's see, I think maybe in a way I do it. Well, the pink player is a, a two cards, guys, so won't do anything about the pink player as of now. We leave, we leave him for the last, but right where I want to see if I have enough trips to eliminate the rest of the players from the game. At the very least, right where I can see I could eliminate... It's okay, could I eliminate the purple player right there, guys? Or should I go after the blue player, guys? Right? We'll go... Let's go right there like this, guys. Let's see, I think I sh Yes, I should just simply go right there, guys. Blitz purple and then blitz the blue player strips as well to finish eliminating the purple player from the game. Let's go. Right? Yes, yeah, super good blitz right there, guys. Let's go. Let's blitz some trips, guys. 100% blitz over there as well. Let's blitz this for extra trips. The purple player gets eliminated from the game and can I have enough trips to eliminate? The blue player too, guys, so it doesn't really seem so, in all honesty, right? So, okay, that I means we can still try, guys, and at the end I'll try to invade, like how to invade the pink player. Let's go, let's attack over these right there, guys, right? Yes, I do not think that will be enough troops. Let's go, right? Right there, let's stay as loyal allies with the pink player, guys. Let's just simply still let him call this hole, guys, that's fine. Three troops by blue. Right there, plus four additional troops, the guys doesn't matter. If the pink player wants, you could <laughs> end up betraying me first, right there, guys. Let's see, right, it's a blue player trying to eliminate pink, in that case... Yeah, that won't be enough troops, right there, okay. It seems like he's trying to break through me right there, guys, which is fine. Right, thing. please attack a blue player, please help me out. So you get the second place because right there, it's obvious what you can't win right there anymore. So unless I disconnect from the game, which is super unlikely to happen, right, well, nine throws by you. So let's see what do you do, right? Yes, good game, well played, blue. Let's see, right, well, turn through party right there, guys. Right, goes out to the territory, so for blue player, guys, are right, really <laughs> loyal to the end, right, very nice. Right, so hard to you. 16 troops by me, we'll make sure to eliminate the blue player from the game, let's do it. Let's add more troops right there, like this, guys, I'm forced to trade on a set at the same time, too. I'll put these troops right there. Let's go, let's just simply take over these extra territories right there, guys, at the same time, too. Right, so now let's switch to the blue player's territories. Let's go, let's eliminate him from the game. Three extra cards, some force to trade in another set. Let's go. Okay, yes, good game, well played. Thank you for being such a good ally pink. More troops, right there, more troops, right there, guys. Right, should be enough troops to completely wipe out the pink player from the game, guys. Let's go. Let's go with this additional army, right there. Right. 11 trip splits, 100% bits guys. Let's wipe him out from this villa territory. And that's a GG. Novice, novice, beginner, expert, and beginner.